Hey YouTube, Tutu UK back again. Yes, I am still alive. Um, severe man flu, as uh, most of you gents out there would know, is an absolute killer. I survived it. I'm here, alive and kicking. Right, um, as you can see, it's pretty dark in here, so I'm not sure how this video is going to turn out, to be honest. I've got the backlight on the camera, I've got the light up in on here, and it's, it's pretty shit. So that's still going to be the peril of doing midweek uh, videos, unfortunately. Um, what I'm going to crack on with anyway, this is it, there is no car boot by the way, that's it, that's done and dusted, so it's just purely like pickups, trades, etc, etc. Um, first things first, pick up from a very good YouTuber, a very good, well, I'll class him as a friend anyway, Simon, BG Bear, I'll, I'll link it down below. Uh, we did a trade, I sent him uh, obviously um, the game, which you, you can all check out down below. Uh, what he had for trade, uh, and, he, and to be fair, like I said, he didn't know if it worked or, or what not, I still haven't tested it. But again, these things are built for destruction. Anyway, it was a Sega Mega Drive Mark One. Okay, I've been after one of these um, because basically I need another one because I want to region mod it, um, put some uh, switches on it and stuff like that. Um, so I need one as a backup. And he very kindly included two uh, extra controllers. So really chuffed that. Oh, hang on, there's a note in here. Really chuffed for that, Simon. Thank you very much. And the note reads: Hey, Stuart, here's the get. Here's the console. I promised. Hope it is in working condition. If it isn't, I hope you can fix it. No, fix anything, mate. No worries. If, if it's not, don't worry. Um, like I say, I've had tons of consoles and brought them back from the dead, so that shouldn't be a problem. So many thanks to Simon for that. Like I say, guys, check his channel out for sure. Okay, it's a top YouTuber. Um, really nice chap. And uh, oh, I would like to say thank you to all the subscribers as well. And uh, anyone who hasn't subscribed, click the button. Um, anyway, pickups from Gordon Bennett, it's been a while, isn't it? Uh, I don't know when I got these, so I'm just going to rattle through what I picked up. I picked up uh, quite a few uh, Master System games. Um, these two are in absolutely mint condition, and um, yeah, I got, I got them for, for, for quite a, a decent price. So the first one is Sagaya on the Master System. Actually, pretty good shoot. I, I couldn't stop playing this game. It's box with a manual. Uh, box in beautiful condition. Really, really impressed with that actually. And the next one is Time Soldiers. Okay, again, boxed and complete. The instructions. I folded the instructions back because there's a kinky. I was just trying to straighten them out a bit. Uh, so there's them two there. I picked up, or I got packages, whatever you want to call it. Two in the post today. Okay, first one is Black Belt, which has got the old destructions. Okay. Box is doing that weird thing, you know, when it collapses on itself, which is a bit of a bugger. But hey ho, what can you do? And the other one, which um, doesn't come in instructions, is Great Volleyball. Um, there we go. And you see, this is one of the games that I never actually played on the Master System, so I'm looking forward to a blast on that. Um, I'll probably have to do another video because I've picked up shitloads of stuff that I know I haven't shown you guys. Um, what have I got here? PlayStation 1 stuff. Um, I picked these up. Ah, these were from, um, not crack converters, crack generator or whatever you want to call it. Um, first one is Strikers 1945. I know a few people have picked this up now. Again, another solid shooter that is. I mean, I, I paid, uh, I think, 45p for this. 49p, sorry, 49p. It's a crackdown front, but it's PlayStation games for you, isn't it? Um, next one is. Battle Gotham City Racer. Again, 49p. All, these, these are all complete, by the way. Um, this one, sadly, isn't complete. Okay, But I did only pay 49p for it. And that's Digimon Build. Which I thought was an absolute steal. Sadly, like I said, there's no instructions. It's just it's just a, uh, a disc case and everything else. So, yeah. so 49p. You can't go wrong with that, eh? so I just need to find me, try and source me a, a set of instructions for that bad boy. Um, these ones, these two here, were from um, Game Station. Um, this one was one ninety nine. Resident Evil, first one, Platinum, which I don't have. It's complete. This one was, I think, in the two ninety nine one. It's nearly complete, except it's missing the insert, and it's Silent Hill, Black Label. Um, and I, I, obviously I don't own this. 
It's got everything out in it, everything out bar the insert. So if anyone's got a spare insert knocking about for silent hit, I thought that was the insert, it's not, it's like a little catalogue. If anyone's got a spare insert knocking about for Silent Hill, if they can drop me a PM, that'd be absolutely superb. Or even a set of instructions for Digimon World, you know. Let me know, guys, we'll sort something out. Um, this one, I couldn't believe it when I seen this. This is in a charity shop. Um, and it, I think there's one of, one of only two games, there was this and some shite driving game on there. Um, it was marked up at um, was it two ninety nine or something like that? yeah two ninety nine I think uh, so I haggled it down in the charity shop as you do um, because that was a weird thing these were two ninety nine and their Xbox and PS two games were um, two quid so I think I got this I got this for two fifty which is a fucking steal anyway regardless it's Marvel superheroes and it's complete it's absolutely fucking mint condition as well. So really chuffed to pick that up. You know what I say, look, it's all there, uh, it's all there. Uh, so um Yeah, I mean I hope it's coming through okay and the camera guys you know, I thought I'd better get a video up because I'm feeling better. Uh, and I didn't want to wait till Saturday either. Um early in the week, early in the week on the Tuesday, yesterday, uh, I popped in to the charity shop and uh, I couldn't believe me look, because I just don't just don't see these games now. And not like this either. Uh, so I was in the charity shop, I looked around, you know, on the shelves and that. And it didn't wasn't much there. And as I looked up from looking at the um, CDs, there was that. And I took a double take, and what it was is a batch of NES games. So what I picked up, boxed NES, Robocop. And again, like, I mean, this is in okay condition. I mean, I think for a NES box, this is in okay condition. I mean, there's probably you know some people really pick it out there that will probably turn it down. Um, oh, there's a Total Tactics notepad in there. I didn't. I, uh, to be honest, like I say, I finally looked at these. Uh, okay, there's no instructions with Robocop, unfortunately. I thought they were the instructions. It's not. It's a tactics thing, but it's boxed anyway. Um, so that's Robocop. I'll tell you the, 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 the story and the prices on this in a minute because it, it doesn't end here. Um, so we've got Robocop. This is in really good condition. I mean, NES open. I mean, really mint box this is. Uh, again, I think this is missing instructions as well, sadly. Yeah, that's missing the instructions as well. I guess. But say it's all there, look. And uh, these, these, these two are what caught my eye initially. I mean, I love this series anyway. So I've got Double Dragon 1 and 2. Um, again, I don't. I can't, I'm not sure if these have got. No, no. Oh, hang on, there's something else in here. Yes, it's got the instructions. All creased up to to how though. That's a shame. Oh, I'll get them straightened out. So that has got the instructions. Let's put that down there because we get straightened out. And uh, there's the cart. I mean, absolutely mint condition. Absolutely mint condition. Proper Nintendo sleeve. So there's that one. Again, the box is in really good condition on this as well. And then uh, Double Dragon 2, again, excellent condition. I think there's some instructions in this, it feels like it anyway. But yeah. So we've got the instructions all creased and... And a Nintendo, Club Nintendo! Yay! Can I sign up to that? Is it still going? So... Oh. So yeah, so there's a there's Double Dragon 2. And weirdly enough, that's not in an official Nintendo. Well, these are listed at uh, £3.50. So I did pay £3.50, of course. Me being me. Got them down to three quid a piece, which I thought was quite good actually. Um I then sort of said to the, the old the old bird beyond the counter. 
Um, have you got the game? Have you, have you got the machine for this? I said. Oh, I don't know. Let me go and have a look. Alison! So she's shouting out the back. Alison! Oh, fucking, and obviously the, the shot's filling up and that. And I'm holding the queue up and thinking, oh, fucking hell. She's for 10 minutes shouting this woman's name. So if she's down in the pit where they sort all the shit out. So anyway, this woman come up and I was expecting some old crow and she was like, you know, nice young lady ish, well, older, probably about my age. And uh, I just sort of said about the games, because obviously she got that, sorry, she got the reduction to three quid. So it was three quid, after speaking to this Alison, and then said, oh, the, the, he's asking about the, 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 the machine for it. I said, oh, yeah, but I've got the machine. She said, oh, yacht, you mean the, the NES? I said, yeah. She said, well, we have, but we can't sell it because it's, it's got no power. <laughs> I said, oh, don't worry about that. She said, well, meet me round the back. And I thought, what, for the games console or for something else? I think it was for the games console anyway. So I went round the back and uh, opened the little hatch door. And what she showed me is an action set. And I was like, whoa. Couldn't believe me look. Um, it's boxed. It's got the zapper. Okay, the box ain't in the greatest condition. One of the the top um, flaps ripped off. The zap is in really in really good condition. It says, I mean, it looks really good condition. I said the box is ain't great. The polystyrene ain't great. Uh, it comes with two controllers and the console. This is definitely obviously some kids. Yeah, um, thing. Like I say, look, see the flap there. It's slightly torn. It's a bit of a bummer. I've got the, all the polystyrenes there, albeit slightly mashed up. Um, ah, okay. This, to be honest, this is, one, this is the first time I've looked at this. I, I looked in it and seen that the console was there. So it's got uh, both control pads, RF, and then um, a completely mullered. Completely mullered Nez, it's all obviously bought a lot like Total, anyway, that's for sure. Um, it's covering stickers. Following the tip from Bithead 1000, let's open it. Hey. Ivan Iron Man Stewart, super off road racing, eh? Yeah, what about that? It's a free Brucey bonus. So that's a loose car. I may have to go back. So anyway, so I've got there's that. Pick that up from, and um, I managed to to bag the console and um, then four games, fifteen quid. So in basically, I paid three quid for the for the NES. Which ain't bad, I don't think. Okay, the box somewhat dubious. Console, I can clean all the stickers and all the crap off anyway. I've got I've got two nezes upstairs that I can transplant anyway, and the zapper. I didn't think that was a bad bad steal to be honest. Um, Fifteen quid. Um, what else did I pick up? Um, I think there was something else, but I forgot now. Um, I've got a, a, a ton. I've got a few, well, quite a few um, PlayStation Two games. I need to sort them out. Um, and, and show you guys that. But I thought I wanted to get the video up anyway. Obviously, I'm still alive. And um, yeah, and, and yeah, obviously, there's no car boots anymore, so it's, it's pick up some of the. Um, get some of the consoles chipped, chipped, modded, get some gameplay footage up. Fingers crossed, I've got hopefully something coming in the post, which I'm really looking forward to and really excited about. Um, so I'll show you guys that when it. Or them when it turns up, if it turns up, it better turn up. And um, yeah, I mean, I'm not sure about making videos in the evening because I don't know what this is going to turn out. I probably look like I'm in a black hole. But other than that, anyway. So moving swiftly on, uh, I know there's quite a few you chaps are probably going to uh, replay in uh, Blackpool. I'm not. Um, just other commitments and stuff like that, but I'm, I'm, you know, I'm definitely going to get my name down for some of these events for next year and uh, save some pennies and, and, and get on board. Um, so enjoy it, guys. Be safe and um, hope you pick up a load of goodies and that and have a cracking time. Okay, YouTube, take it easy and I'll speak to you soon.